Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be playing Ocarina of Time, and this is the beginning of a playthrough. I streamed this back when I was first learning how to stream, and I never finished a playthrough, so I've always wanted to come back and actually do that, and now I am. Uh, I'm going to be using this. This is a retro bit. Uh, N64 wireless controller that's been changed to look a little bit more like a GameCube controller. It's way more comfortable. Um, and I like it that way. So, as I keep on trying to do, our character is... Rockstar Lou Reed. Because that's a joke that's funny to me. Now... God willing, the setting should be just fine. Everything should be okay. Move this a little more this way. Let's see, we have the children of the forest. The Kokiri live here with me. We are the great Deku true speaking. Each Kokiri has her or her own guardian fairy. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. Quite unfortunate. He's cold because I guess also he doesn't have a blanket. Comfort, bed sheets. I don't have a soda and water here. Refreshing. Ah! Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. Oh, Navi the fairy, listen to my words, the words of the Deku tree. Dost thou sense it? The climate of evil descending upon this realm. Malevolent forces, even now, are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri Forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But, before this tremendous evil power, even my power is as of nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly. The fate of the forest, nay, the world, depends upon me. He's like, ah, oh, shit, dude, I gotta get the fuck out of here. Look. Hello. Now, if I remember correctly, last stream we established, even though even though that stream didn't work out and I didn't continue that that progress, we established that Navi actually has a really deep, gruff voice and is basically like a a wise guy. I'm telling a wise guy who's maybe in the mob. <laughs> so uh, we got to remember that voice. Here we go. Hello. Hello, Lou Reed, wake up. The great Deku Tree wants to talk to you. Lou Reed, get up. Hey. Hey, come on. Can Iroh's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? That's a 3D model on a picture. You finally woke up! I'm Navi the Fairy! The Great Deku asked me to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. The Great Deku Tree has summoned you, so let's get going right now! Oh god, okay, here we go. Okay, Rita. Hmm. 
Yahoo! Hi, Marie! Hey, we'll just brought talking to you. <laughs> wow, a fairy! Finally, a fairy came to you, Marie! Wow, that's great news! I'm so happy for you! Now you're a true Kokiri, Lurid. Is that right? The great Deku Tree has summoned you? It's quite an honor to talk to the great Deku Tree. I'll wait for you here. Get going! Go see the great Deku Tree! Ah, they're not talking. Okay, so. Uh, like I said last time, but again, you don't know because I didn't save that stream. Uh, this is going to be a 100% play playthrough because that's what I did uh, when I first played it, which was what what I remember. It was like 20 years ago. It was when I first discovered emulation. I got an N64 emulator and played through this game um, using like a Logitech controller. I want to say that was maybe 2003 or 2004. I can't remember. But yeah, I have not played this game all the way through since then. Um, I remember really liking the game back then. I did not think it was like amazing, five out of five, one of the, the greatest games of all time type of thing, but I did like it. I thought it was like a four out of five. So, we'll see how I feel about it now. Now that I'm gonna play through it once again. 20, nearly 20 years later, with a lot of hindsight behind me. And I did try to stream this game. God, it must have it must have been like eight years ago now. And I didn't finish it, and during that playthrough, all I got was, I believe, as far as uh, Zelda's castle. I went and saw her and got um, the letter from Impa, and I stopped there. I only streamed, I think, for like an hour, hour and a half, maybe. I plan to be here a lot longer, so we should get a lot more done. I'm, I'm hoping to get, like, maybe all of the pendants. We'll see. We'll, I think I can at least really easy pull off, like, the Douglas Cambered. The great Dekuchu has summoned you. Please come with me. Okay, now this is the part that I want to fix. For some reason, this part appears glitchy. But before it was like chugging. And now it's not chugging, it's just for some reason it like drops frames. Which I'm just gonna have to live with. Alright, so now we need some monies. We have to pick up the money. Hey. A lot more money than that. So we've got a fiver up there. Wait, isn't this stuff over in here? And then four chests? Yeah. You know, something that I did try to do, uh, I think it was last year, is I did load up uh, a randomizer for this game, and I tried to play through that, and I got, I, like, fairly far, but eventually I got stuck. <laughs> I was just like, I can't, I don't know what to do now, I don't know this game well enough. If anyone's watching in the chat, I can't see who's actually watching, but I can see that I do have the chat window up, so if you got something you gotta say to me, feel free. Back is not gonna be appreciated though. I, I, I don't want that. Oh god. Don't fall. Hee hee hee, you came all the way up here. You're a real man. Look, isn't it the view pretty? Change your viewpoint with 
see up so you can look around the forest with the square, with the circle, the elastic. You fucking know what I mean. <laughs> Yeah. Hi, Lou Reed. Look this way. Look over here with Z and talk to me with A. Yes, yes. That's how you use a fairy. It's so great that you finally have a fairy partner. I'll teach you how to talk to people using your fairy. When the fairy flies near a person or thing, press Z to look in that direction. If you use Z targeting, you can talk to people from a distance, like we're doing now. When you have nothing that you can target, you can press Z just to look forward. Try it. Yeah. That's a plus and a minus. Sometimes I wish that was two different buttons. Hey, you, Mr. No Fairy. What's your business with the Great Deku Tree? Without a fairy, you're not even a real man. What? You got a fairy? Say what? The Great Deku Tree actually summoned you? What? Why would he summon you and not the Great Mido? This isn't funny. I don't believe it. You weren't even fully equipped yet. How do you think you're going to help the Great Deku Tree without both a sword and shield ready? What? You're, you're right. I don't have my equipment ready. But if you want to pass through here, you should at least equip a sword and a shield. Sheesh. You remember way back in the day, this motherfucker. Sheesh! How the hell did something like that catch on? It's so weird. That's such a strange expression. Damn, Gen Zers. Uh, let's see, I need three more rupees. I need to buy the shield, and it's 40 bucks. Ah. Ah. We got one. Ah. Ah. Two. Hey, there we go. Give me the shield. I buy. You got a Deku shield. Switch to the equipment subscreen and select the shield. Press A to equip it. Press R to crouch and defend. If you press R while Z targeting, you can move while defending. Should I buy something else? No, I'm broke. Got nothing else. You just took all my money. Okay. Equipment. Done. Alright, jerk off. If you want to see the Great Deku Tree, you should at least equip the sword and shield. And what's that? Oh, you have a Deku shield? And what's that? Is that the Kokiri sword? Good grief! Well, even with all that stuff, a whip is still a whip, huh? I, the Great Mido, will never see, will never accept you as one of us. Shoot, how did you get to be the favorite of Saria? Uh, Saria and the great Deku Tree, huh? Get the fuck out of my way, you jealous bastard. <laughs> Assholes. You got a Deku stick. Select item menu, subscreen, you can select it with uh, C left, C down, or C right. Set it to C and swing with C. When you want to put it away, stand still and press A. You can carry up to 10 sticks, but don't waste them. <laughs> you are weapon fodder to me. Great Deku Tree. Hey, Great Deku Tree, I'm back.
O Nami, thou hast returned. The reed, welcome. Listen carefully to what I, the Deku Tree, am about to tell thee. Thy slumber in these past wounds must have been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of evil gain strength, a vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. Verily thou hast felt it. Lou Reed, the time has come to test thy courage. I have been cursed. I need you to break the curse with your wisdom and courage. I don't know shit about this. Dost thou take courage enough to undertake this task? It should be no, but I don't really have a choice, so yes. Then enter, brave young, young Lou Reed, and thou too, Navi. I keep adding young in there. Navi the fairy, thou must aid Lou Reed. And Lou Reed, when Navi speaks, use see up to listen well to her words of wisdom. Alright, let's do it! First dungeon! Man, they drop you right into it real quick in these games. That's a good thing about the older ones. It's not like, like Twilight Princess, which takes like an hour or two to, to really get into it. Which is a shame because I actually really like Twilight Princess. That's arguably my favorite 3D Zelda. <laughs> But it's just, it's beginning sucks. You got a Deku nut. Let's left screen, you can set it to blah blah blah, I already know that. Set it to so that it will flash and stun the enemy. Hey. Give me some money. go what oh oh now you go away okay hmm, can't do anything about those guys yet but I can't open this chest Watch me get my treasure, you asses. You found the dungeon map. Press start to get into the subscreens and look at the map subscreen. Blue chambers are places you have already visited. Your current location is the flashing room. Move up and down to select the floor to view. I still can't do anything about you guys. You can open a door by standing in front of it and pressing A. Pay attention to what the action icon says. That's the blue icon at the top of the screen. Yes, it is. Eh. Wrong button. There we go. Forgive me, Master, but I give you a clue. Will you let me go? When you jump off a high cliff, if you hold forward on the analog stick, you will roll on the ground when you land and won't get hurt from the fall. I can't guarantee it will work, though, if the cliff is really, really high. <laughs> well, try it if you are feeling bold. <laughs> Shot. That's all those that in that giant chest. <laughs> you found the slingshot. You can attach it. Uh, take it out as you hold it. You can aim with the analog stick. Release C to unleash a Deku seed. If you want to shoot right away, when you first press C, hold down C a little longer to get a seed ready. Right. Another treasure chest. Smaller one. Heart that I don't need. Oh well. Okay, now I equipped. Hmm. 
probably put these up there too. Might as well. Okay. Watch out. Okay, okay. Can you go over here? As well, the vines growing on it give it a rough surface. Maybe you can climb it, Lou Reed. You got Deku seeds. These are small hard seeds that you can use as bullets for your slingshot. Great. chest you found the compass now you can see the locations of many hidden things in the dungeon sweet um, yeah so there's something in this room something in the basement and that's it. Give me the thing that's in the basement. Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to do this again. Destroyed a gold scotola. You got a token improving. You destroyed it. Oh, I'm gonna be seeing that prompt a lot, like 99 more times. Let's see something.
Okay, just those guys waiting there. Yup. Wrong button. Destroy this ghost. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. Forgive me, Master. I'll never do it again. If you spare me, I'll teach you something cool. You will never beat my brothers up ahead unless you punish them in the proper order. The order is... 2, 3, 1. 23 is number 1. You think I'm a traitor? Yay, heart. Shut up. Another heart. Take your seats. And even more Deku seeds. Okay. A little more elaborate this time. After you get into the water, if you hold down A, you can dive. I bet there are some interesting things in the water. Oh, wait, that thing's gonna hit me. Stand next to this block and grab hold of it with A. While holding A, you can push or pull it. If you stand next to the block and press A while pressing the red analog stick or analog stick towards the block, you can climb on top of it. Pay attention to what the action icon says. I know, man. I know all of this. Yeah. 
Are they respawning? What the hell? I think they might be. Treasure or something in here? Did I already get it? I fucked up! So I pushed this thing down first. Delicious dungeon! Yeah! How did you know our secret? How irritating! It's so annoying that I'm going to reveal the secret of Queen Gomas to you. In order to administer the coup de grace to Queen Goma, strike her with your sword while she's stunned. Oh, Queenie, 
Sorry about that. Alright, let's do this. Dungeon 1. The final boss of Dungeon 1. <laughs> Parasitic Armored Arachnid, Goma! Shit, disintegrated. And hey, look, you did it! Nice job! You got a heart container. Your maximum life energy is increased by one heart. Your life is your life energy will be totally refilled. Yay! Well, 15 minutes? Something like that? 47? Well done, Lou Reed. Thou hast barely demonstrated thy courage. Now, I knew that thou's, thou wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. Now I have yet one, I have yet more to tell you. Wouldst thou listen? Yep. Laying on me, here's the info dump. Now listen carefully. A wicked man of the desert cast this dreadful curse upon me. This evil man ceaselessly uses his vile sorcerer's powers in his search for the sacred realm that is connected to Hyrule. For it is in that sacred realm that one will find the divine relic, the Triforce, which contains the essence of the gods. Ooh, pretty. Before time began, before spirits and life existed, three golden goddesses descended upon the chaos that was Hyrule. Din, the goddess of power. Nairu, the goddess of wisdom. Pharaoh, the goddess of courage. With her 
strong flaming arms, she cultivated the land and created the red earth. Nairu poured her wisdom onto the earth and gave the spirit of law to the world. Faro, with her rich soul, produced all life forms which would uphold the law. The three great goddesses, their labors completed, departed for the heavens, and golden sacred triangles remained at the point where the goddesses left the world. Since then, the sacred triangles have become the basis of our world's providence, and the resting place of those triangles has become the sacred realm. Thou must never allow the desert man in black armor to lay his hands on the sacred triforce. <coughs> Thou must never suffer that man with his evil heart to enter the sacred realm of legend. That evil man who cast the death curse upon me and sapped my power. Because of that curse, my end is nigh. Though your valiant efforts to break the curse were successful, I was doomed before you started. Yes, I will pass away soon, but do not grieve for me. I have been able to tell you of these important matters. This is Hyrule's final hope. Lou Reed, go now to Hyrule Castle. There thou wilt surely meet the Princess of Destiny. Take this stone with you, the stone that man wanted so much that he cast a curse on me. There we go. I was like, don't I get a pendant here? The Kokiru's Emerald. This is the spiritual stone of the forest, now entrusted to you by the great Deku Tree. Spiritual stone, excuse me. Pendants are uh, linked to the past. The future depends upon thee, Lou Reed. Thou art courageous. Navi the fairy, help Lou Reed to carry out my will. I entreat ye, Navi. Good. Bye. Yeah. Let's go to Hyrule Castle, Lou Reed. Goodbye, Great Deku Tree. Mm, so sad.